This veteran fleet professional and most recent past president of Napa gives us her thoughts on some challenges facing today's fleet manager. So last year had some very good low rates, um, fuel has been down. So my concern is all of the rising costs for operating a fleet. So it's not just fuel, uh, maintenance went up, um, our financing's going up. Probably the only advantage right now is resale on vehicles is going up. So it's a little bit offsetting that. I think we've had a lot of dialogue with Treasury um, at the beginning stages and even when it was down so low to say, should we, should we really do some hedging? What's the tolerance of the company? Do they want to do something like that? Or should we float with the market, understanding and really doing a, what our internal budgeting might be? So we are actually floating with the market. Um, we did a budget and we forecasted that it would be higher, kind of where it is now, um, but we didn't get approval for that in our budget. So um, we, we know we're gonna be off slightly, but we're hoping some of the gains and some of the other parts of uh, fleet operations will balance that. So fuel's a big cost. So for all of us, I think it's really recognizing how do we change the type of vehicles that we're doing, how do we become more fuel efficient all the way along from most everybody's gone to four cylinders where they could. Um, a big part of our sustainability plan has enabled us to actually focus really closely on fuel and the total cost. So we're, we're really conscious about that and making good decisions for the fleet vehicles that fuel is a key factor.